I say we meet fire with fire. What's great about Alec is you never know what he's going to do next. I don't ever know what he's going to do next. In action! Alec was a, a character that, that jumped off the page as someone who had so much going on in his life. He's quite a hard character. They're nervous, Dad. You haven't exactly had your eye on the ball lately. He battles with himself the whole time. He battles with who he is, and he lies to himself an awful lot. There's a complexity to anyone, and I don't think it's ever too good to take on a character that's so far flung away from what, what you're used to in your own personal experience. Hey, Mark. But you just drawn it. You've drawn little, little pieces which are really unexpected. And I ended up thinking about my grandfather a lot or thinking about, you know, things like that which really moved me, and I just try as best I can to, to bring that onto set and, and use it as much as I can. His relationship with his father is a really tricky one because he loves him and he's so loyal, Alec. You're not. You're not. What? The man I once was. If you love somebody and you're trying nothing but to please them and you're getting no love in return, no respect and no gratitude back. He won't listen to me. Who? Dad. At the same time, Alec is an incredibly confident, strong guy. He's a leader, a natural-born leader, and having, having that repressed is so emasculating. How long are you going to keep waiting on Daddy's permission? I want people to, to empathize with Alec, to feel for him. And for that to be the case, it has to come from a real place.